Hello everyone, it's Andrew from Tech Support. In our previous video, we created a couple of custom variables for our algorithm and set a reaction as SMS sending. Today, we will investigate one more possible reaction. We will maintain the outputs. Galileo's car tracker outputs can be used to connect various executive devices light indication, buzzers, and even more complex mechanisms, for example, engine fuel supply. In the description to this video, you can see an instruction on how to connect such devices to our outputs. Each output has two different states. It can be opened or closed. When it's opened, external device is powered and starts working, while when it's closed, the power circuit is incomplete and the device stops working. You can manage the outputs using the block Change Output. We set two parameters, number of the tracker output and its state, 0 for opened and 1 for closed. Let's presume we have a light diode connected to output 0. Let's set a reaction using this diode. One long signal for ignition on and three short signals when it's turned off. The diode shouldn't be working most time, so in the beginning we close the output. When the ignition status is changed, diode will react only once, so we'll add the output change right after the SMS sending. When ignition is on, we open the output, add a delay of 2 seconds and close the output. When ignition is off, we open and close the output three times, with small delays of 200 milliseconds. We can make the algorithm simpler for understanding by creating custom variables on and off instead of 0 and 1. By this simple move, we created a working algorithm of ignition control for the driver and the dispatcher, which we can save for further use. In our next video, we will show how to delete algorithms from the tracker and from remote server. Bye, everyone!